So this is a quick video. Um, I did not know these existed, but I never had the need for expanding my ethernet uh, capacity out of my router. But now because of all the apps that you can use to turn off lights, open garages, uh, doorbell cameras, security cameras, this is a needed thing now. So this is a five port gigabyte um, made by T-Link um, desktop. They call it a desktop switch. But again, what you're trying to do here is very well done in this picture. So you have your power cord here, it plugs into the wall, regular AC um, right there. And then you can take ethernet cables, which this doesn't come with. And after you hook it to your router, I'll show it to you at the end of the video. It's, it's not complicated. So you'll take the, the, basically what you do is you'll take the, 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 Ethernet cable coming out of your router and you're going to plug it into, as you can see, one of these ports in the back. Now it's my understanding it doesn't matter which port it goes into. But then if you have, again, like I was telling you, uh, here is, uh, they're using computers, different computers as pictures. The application I'm gonna use it for is because of what I just told you, all these other gadgets that I now have in my house. So. There is um, some run speeds here uh, that they talk about and um, believe it's right here. Yeah, so there, when it's on, that green light will turn on and it will be green. You can mount it. So it has these little mounting holes in it if you wanna, like for example, I don't know, like hang it on the wall like this. I, I don't see the reason for that. Um, and then they do give you these, these felt feet that um, you could put on the bottom if you don't want to scratch a, a nice surface. So what I'll do is I'll move over. I bought the, I'll put a link in the description below. I bought it on Amazon for $10. It was super cheap. There's some of the specs on it if you're into all this stuff as far as speeds and things like that. But again, I'll what I'm going to do is hook it up in the closet where all my uh, cables run through my house. And I'll just show you how the wires run. All right, so as promised, I'm going to show you how to connected and i'm gonna get a ton of a ton of comments about you need to clean up your closet here i had to disassemble some things to make this work right but i just wanted to show you in the end so this um again is my modem but this line is going into my um my uh this is my Eero, my my mesh system and then on the back of that it's got two ports and that's it so again one's going into the modem and then the other one meaning this other one is going into the back of the splitter. And then what that allowed me to do is add this white cable, which is going to this cable, this uh, box for cameras. Um, and then I also can, can, can control um, my garage door and then lights and a few other things. So I can plug that one in here and then I still have two left if I need it. So I know this is very jumbled looking and not ideal. So don't make yours look like this. I'll clean it up, but I wanted to attach it because by the time I clean it up, you're not gonna be able to see these back ports. So it's really simple, but just make sure, again, everything is connected the correct way. So modem to, if you have one of these um, systems and then that system connects into here, which then everything else can feed out of that. Hope that helps.